Okay, so today we're going to be talking about comparing three digit numbers, but on a number line. A lot of the times we can use number lines to help us realize, well, which number is bigger, right? That's what I mean by comparing. We're looking at what number is bigger and what number is smaller. So our first number that we have right here is 537. 537. Hmm. I know that 500s is 500 and 37. So I know that it's not in the middle, right? 550 would be between 500 and 600. So I would put it about right here, right? 537. It's not yet to 600, but it's a little bit more than 500. Then I wanna look at 289. That's pretty close to 300, but not quite there yet. So let's look at the first place value. 200s. Where do we find 200s? Right here. 200. So I know it's more than 250. So it's going to be past the middle, a little bit closer to 300, just not there quite. So I'm going to plot 289. Now that I've put both of these numbers on my number line, it's pretty easy to see which one's greater, right? Which one do you think is greater? 537, it's higher on our number line, our number line goes up. So, if I had the option, I'd rather eat 537 cookies rather than 289. You always need more cookies, right? So I'm gonna put my mouth towards 537. Wanna try another? Let's erase this. Let's try a little bit more of a tricky one. See if I can get you. Okay, let's do 432 and 342. First, you want to think to yourself, what is similar about these numbers? They have all of the same digits, right? I have a three, a four, a three, a four, and a two, and I have a three, a four, and a two. But they're not the same number. And that's because of place value, right? Here I have how many hundreds? Yeah, four hundreds. So I'm gonna go right down to 400. I know it's not halfway because it's a little less than 50. So right here I'm gonna mark 432. And then I'm gonna look at 342. How many hundreds do I have? three hundreds. So I want to go down to 300 and I'm pretty close to 350 so it's pretty close to being in the middle here. So 342. Now which one's bigger? Which one is farther along on our number line? That's right. 332. Okay. So your first step today is to draw your number line And two, plot your first number, and then three, plot second number, four, determine which is greater. Good luck, second graders.